going on, everybody? Welcome back to another episode of Sea Skylines. My name is Sports Monkey. Welcome, 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 welcome back to Springfield. In this episode, we are going to build some transportation hubs. For example, I want to build a train metro hub and a couple other hubs that are part of the new DLC, Sunset Harbor. I truly do believe that they will help us out in the long term here for our city. So, for over here, I want to build this train metro hub over here near our our tourist district and our high density residential so i would like to place it now the thing is is when you're placing this new dlc train metro hub oh uh, you are going to you have to figure out what side is which so i'm actually going to place. so basically what i want to do is connect the train line over here from the outside area so we can get tourists like so see how that goes to the outside of our grid or our our city so i want to build that and then i want to connect it to the metro so um you know thank you and i just want to say thank you guys for following liking and subscribing thank you thank you thank you i do appreciate it uh you know keep doing that if you have yet to subscribe hit that subscribe button if you have yet to like this like or comment please make sure you do so and now let's let's keep going let's get into the nitty-gritty now let's see we're gonna place the, i want it i want that there but i need to make sure which one is which so i believe that i actually did this correctly that this is for the train line so let's now the reason why i think that is because see those electrical lines to the right and see those electrical lines to the left those match up pretty well. So let's connect it. So let's get over here and we're gonna connect it up. That's okay, the gradual in de incre de incline and decline, that is okay with me. I'm okay with that, that shouldn't be an issue. Now, that works out really freaking well. Now, the next thing we need to do is connect the Metro. The metro, remember, is the underground. There you go. It's the underground train. So we are connecting that. And let's see. Connect it right there. So that metro line is connected up. Now what I also want to do is kind of loop it over here and connect it to our main metro line. So let's get over here. And it is above ground. So we do need to put it below ground. Now let's bring that over here and what I want to do is bring that metro line like build a line to our hub so what I mean by that is that there is a train hub or a metro hub let's see and does it go over here yes it goes over here and then it goes over here kind of like what we did with the tourist district I just want to I want to do that just like I said just for that metro train hub and but basically have the same kind of line I mean we could easily have extended it but I want I want it to have its own line so all the way to here so that is pretty perfect and then you know what maybe hmm, let's extend it out into the suburbs a little bit that's all right it's not honestly a big deal let's go over here go over here Boy, this is going to be a really long metro line. Ugh. And bring it back down here. We're going to have outside employee. Wow. Now, how do we get back to the... To the hub. Alright, let's bring it back here now. Now let's bring it all the way. Now, we need to bring it back to where we started. So, let's bring it back over here. bring it back over here and then we'll bring it along here no since that already is going to the metro we don't need to do that now let's just close the line right here so this metro is pretty much going every everywhere around the city and this train station is getting passenger tra trains from in and out of the city so it's an intracity station so now let's add some roads to it Let's add, um, since those are, since that is technically a four-lane road, let's just, let's just add to that and not 
try to let's not change it to basically a um, you know to a, a large road. So we'll keep it a medium road, just for aesthetic purposes. Oh boy. Nope. There you go. Alright, that is kind of an aggressive turn, but the problem is, is guess what? We have the airport in the way. <laughs> there you go. Perfect. Awesome. Alright, so that works out really well. Now let's add some water to it. Add some water pipes to it. Now we do need more... Wow, we do. We have a very high demand for residential still, so we might take that into account. But alright, so we have that... Oh, it needs power. Excuse me. Sorry about that. Let's build power lines right over the runway. No, I'm just kidding. I'm not going to do that. Eventually, the, the, these power lines will go away, so I'm not really too worried about that. Um, I think we need to fill in some residential really fast. Holy cow, that is a lot of residential demand. I'm going to get rid of the... Oh, my gosh. There you go. I don't know how I just moved from one side to the next, but that's all right. So let's let's just build a neighborhood over here. We'll fill it in. Nothing too crazy. Nope, not like that though. There's that. And there's that. Perfect. So this is starting to look pretty nice. Not too bad for this neighborhood. And remember, we are still in the tourist district, so we got to be careful with noise pollution. Uh, hopefully that is okay. I'm just assuming it is okay for the time being. If we have to fix that later on, we can fix that. So that shouldn't be an issue. Remember, do not add commercial on a main road because your residents will... Or not add commercial, excuse me. Don't add residential on your main road because they will complain complain about the noise so let's add all of this high industrial or high residential rather perfect awesome so that worked out really really well that should fill in really quickly awesome now let's go to the next transportation hub that i was thinking about um let's go over not the hub excuse me but i wanted to add a cable stop and a cable lift i've actually never added one before so i figured connecting both over both tourist districts would be pretty nice. So what I'm going to do is actually I'm going to start the cable line actually kind of over here. I don't want to screw up that skyscraper. And I'm going to kind of put it around and then it's going to end here. So you're going to... So I'm not going to completely destroy the cityscape. I'm going to... Hopefully not. But I'm going to kind of go around if that makes sense i'm going to try to go around like hug the coast in valid shape okay well i can't make an abrupt turn which makes sense in valid shape there you go and we'll kind of put it so so you don't <laughs> so the view of the stadium does not get ruined we're going to lower it a little bit and then we're going to raise it right back up. Invalid shape. Alright, so make sure you cannot have direct turns going directly. Like, you can't make a U-turn or anything like that. Or like a sharp turn. It needs to be a very gradual turn. As you can tell, I am kind of struggling with that as we speak. Invalid shape. Okay. Okay. Okay, so there's two ends to it. Invalid shape. How is that an invalid shape? I'm going straight. Uh-huh, there's that. Okay, so that's okay. And now City Skylines is not like it. Oh, it's sideways. See, I... Oh my gosh, I did not realize that until just now. Wow. 
Has anybody ever had that, also had that issue? Wow, I've, I've honestly never made one of these before, and I figured it'd be cool to have in my city. And honestly, so there we go. Now we have, now it should be fine. It should work out really well. Now I think we could, I think that should work out really well. Let me see. Yep, and it is open. Awesome. So we have people that are able to take the cable lift. Sweet. And I mean, I, look at, we're going literally along the coast. Like I put it below the, so look at, you're kind of close. <laughs> you don't get a beautiful view of the stadium, but guess what? That works out really well. I like that. Hopefully people use that as a you know, means to get over here. Um, eventually I do need to fill this in. It, don't worry about that now. I understand that, that they, you know, there's not many people coming over here. Not enough customers. Yep. Not enough goods to sell. We'll get to that soon enough. So that looks pretty cool. So now what the next tra public transportation line that I was thinking is since this is a tourist area, we need to create a tourist sightseeing bus depot and get actually get into the sightseeing part of our tourist district so I'm gonna put the oh wait I'm gonna move the bus district or the bus depot over here so it's kind of like out of harm's way now let's build a tourist line so we're gonna do the sightseeing one first and so this is you can tell the purple is where it's the high appeal for our tourists so uh, let's get that started right now and we're gonna start it I believe you know I think we're gonna start it actually probably at the airport create the line we're gonna put a stop over here I know that's early on but you know it, it's okay we'll put a stop right here stop right here stop right here now let's go over to the main part of our tourism stop right here Stop right here. We're just zigzagging, so it has stops in front of every one of our tour sites. How do we? Okay, let's. That's a good spot. Put it there. That's just a normal park. I don't think. I'm, I don't think I'm gonna mess with that. And then we'll go to the main entrance. And then we'll kind of loop it back. I don't think they're going to use leisure, or not leisure, that stadium for, um, oh, we'll see. And then we'll just loop it. There you go. Completed the line. Perfect. Now that is really cool. So we'll have a bunch of buses. I'm going to have to monitor how many buses are actually being used. So, um, you know, so guys, I just wanted to, um, while I'm at, so now the next thing I'm going to add is a, a walking distance, a walking tour. So let's get that done and out of the way. And um, I just wanted to, you know, talk to you guys. Uh, you know, what what are some topics you guys have or other issues you have when creating your city? Um, I'm just wondering if topic-wise, like what works for you guys. If you're, you know, if you're new to this channel or if you're new to City Skylines, like what what do you need to work on? Or what do you want help to work on uh, City Skylines wise? I'm just looking for ideas off you guys. I'm just wondering, you know, what what do you guys want help with? Um, anything like that. I am all for helping you guys out and making a tutorial, building or having a tutorial on it. So uh, just please let me know in the comment section below. That would be greatly appreciated. And guys are always fantastic at commenting so please make sure you keep commenting liking and subscribing and but just let me know what you're interested in uh, basically you know if if you need help with an amusement park the nature reserve building a college you know anything of that sort I will be more than help more than happy to help you out so please let me know in the comment section below and uh, you know that I would greatly appreciate that, honestly. That would be fantastic. So we just created a couple trails that people can walk around our tourist district. So that is really, really awesome. Uh, so far, I would say this is filling in pretty nicely. I have no... Okay, the only issues I see are those housing. 
Why is there residential right there? I don't know why I placed it. That was bad on my part. Anyways, uh, I did see that we... Oh, their cops did take care of it. But I was gonna... I think I need to add a police station over here anyways, so... Add that and a fire station. I know that's boring. <laughs> so, that is perfect. So, actually, we've done a couple good things today. We added this little... Let's see how many people... 407 people are using it. That is awesome. How many people are using... 160. So, people are using our public transportation. And I have not looked at our city in a long time. Like, are people even going to the zoo? Where's our zoo? Look at our zoo. Freaking awesome, man. 19 people. Ooh, that's not good. Okay, we need more people going to that zoo. But, um, overall, I think... Oh, look at that traffic. Ooh, that is not good. We'll figure that one out. 239. Okay, people are definitely using... Oh, man. Waste transfer. Oh, I built the wrong facility. Oh, my God. So, while before I started this episode, I wanted to get... I can't believe I built a waste facility. All right, I wanted a recycling plant, and yet I built two of the wrong buildings. Great. Good job, Sports Monkey. Good job. Anyways. Oh, all right, so... um. Our residential is filling in really nicely, and I'm going to get rid of this, and we're going to make it, we're going to make that high-density residential. Boom. That works out really well. Everything is filling in really, really nicely, and I have no complaints about that. Now, remember I wanted the little shops. Whatever happened to the little shops? Now I have freaking skyscrapers. Ah. <sighs> Whatever, that's okay. There are way worse things in life than that. All right, let's add another unique building. The Amsterdam Palace. That seems like a pretty cool place to visit. That's pretty cool. And then... Um, Ferris wheel on the water would be kind of cool. Kind of like out there, but... I don't think so. I don't think so. We could kind of add this on. There we go. Please tell me that... Oh, no. Let's see if it'll work. There's nothing there. I'm going to build a path to it, but it says it's connected, so I, I think I'll be okay. There you go. So that is just, I believe that that is a ferry museum. Yep, our boat museum. Well, wrong thing. And we, wow, we have 182 people taking the cable card. Wow, that is really cool. I've never, like I said, I've never built that, which for those little gondolas, that is actually quite a bit of people. All right, that worked out really well. Wow, that is really cool. I have no issues at all with that. That is really neat. And so everything seems to be working out really well so far in our city. Um, thank you guys for watching. Like I said, please comment um, any topics you need some help with, tutorial-wise or anything, uh, basic load, road layouts, anything like that. If you have any issues, please let me know in the comment section. But please, otherwise, please like, comment, and subscribe. Springfield is slowly coming around. I mean, it is seriously slowly coming around, and it's becoming a really cool city. So thank you guys for watching. I appreciate it. Have a great rest of your day.